In order to be able to send messages in Windows 10, if you have an Android device, there is two ways to do so that I know of currently. And the first one is by downloading the messages by Google app. If you have a Samsung device like I do here, they do come pre-installed with their own default messaging app. But with the Google app, you could actually go to this website here and link and pair the device to be able to send messages if you don't have your phone with you at some point. So what you need to do is basically open the Play Store, download this app, and then once you download it, go ahead and open the app. It's gonna ask you if you wanna set it as default, go ahead and do so. And as you can see, this is the Samsung app, so I'm just gonna switch it over, set as default. As you can see, my message is loaded. So the instructions basically says to go ahead and click on the three dots here, click on messages for web, and then click on the QR code scanner to open the camera. Go ahead and scan that. And you're gonna get a message that you are all set and then all your messages will basically start loading. And you could basically send a message if you are at work or anywhere else. All right, so this is one of the ways to do so. The second way to do it is in the actual Microsoft Store. There is an application called Your Phone. So I'm just gonna show you that one. So let me go ahead and just close this window. And then if you open the Microsoft Store, you wanna search for the application called Your Phone. Sometimes Windows come already pre-installed with it. All right, and then you click on the application. Once you install the application, you're gonna get this launch message, so go ahead and click that. And then we have a Android device, so click continue. It's gonna tell you to go to this link, so let's go ahead and close the messaging app. And then let's go ahead and open the browser. And then in here, let's go ahead and put in the website that you see there. And then once you put in the link, go ahead and click go. Okay, and then it's gonna ask you, is the QR code on your PC ready? And then just go ahead and click here, yes. And then open QR code. And then in here, you basically click continue on the phone. And then the camera is gonna open. You go ahead and give it permissions while using the app. Scan the code. And now you're gonna hit continue on the phone. Click allow, allow, and then clicking allow and then you're gonna get this message that you are all set and then in the PC you're gonna say a message that you are linked then you click done and now in this screen you could click either deny or allow for improve you could click deny and then you can manage some settings in here as far as what you want to manage and then in here you could basically go to your messages compose a new message and then you could keep this app and basically minimize it and you get notifications when you get a new message. So that's basically how you link the Android device using either the Google Messaging app or the Your Phone application in Windows 10. If you have any questions, leave your comment below and please subscribe.